More than 95,000 bottles of fake whiskey and vodka were seized in an operation at the Valfes Bay port in June this year. The counterfeit products were in transit from the United States of America, as well as Dubai, destined for the Zambian market. The items were confiscated from a South African company which is trading in Namibia. The Customs and Excise Directorate has launched an investigation, after which the case will be handed over to the Attorney General's office for further investigation. It is suspected that the fake Johnny Walker whiskey and Smirnov vodka were produced in the USA and contain potentially dangerous chemicals. The chemicals used to produce the alcohol include, among others, cleaning fluids, nail polish remover, as well as some fuels. Now, drinking this alcohol can cause nausea, it can cause vomiting, abdominal pain, drowsiness. It can really put you straight to a hospital bed. Methanol, a substance, can be used in fake, fake vodka, and that in itself can cause permanent uh, blindness. The Customs and Excise Directorate expressed concern about counterfeit goods in the local market, such as medicines. Namibia mostly rely on imports, and fake products affect the economy negatively. By law, any company importing goods is required to pay taxes to the state. Customs officials also issued a stern warning to criminals involved in counterfeit syndicates. The government of the Republic of Namibia has declared war on the importation of counterfeit products. So whoever out there is trying to really bring in goods that are not legally registered will really face the full wrath of the law. The fake goods were taken to the Valfes Bay dump site and destroyed. Renate Rengura, NBC News, Valfes Bay.